The new Lytro camera looks pretty strange, but that's just the beginning. This camera actually lets you change the focus of a photograph after you've taken it. Once you've snapped your shot, you can check it out either on the camera's touchscreen display or on the computer after downloading it. And if the focus isn't quite right, you can change it. Cool, right? When I tried it out, this feature worked really well. I used the camera to take the photo of my son playing baseball behind a chain link fence. Once I had the picture on my computer, I could switch the camera's focus so either the boy playing ball was crisp and clear, or the fence was. This new camera is easy to use despite its odd shape. And the shutter button works well without much noticeable delay. Our test results show that the Lytro does an excellent job at capturing color, but it's not a print-friendly device. Printed photos will be thumbnail size and low resolution. The Lytro leaves a lot to be desired. It's expensive starting at $400, and right now you can only use it with a Mac computer. Also, it has no flash, no video function, and no manual controls. The touchscreen is nice, but it's very small compared to most other cameras out there. So for now, while we appreciate the cool factor of the new Lytro, it's going to take a fair amount of tweaking before it's ready for prime time. Thank <laughs> you.